Hey y'all, welcome back to my Andy's Music Monday. Um, I haven't done one of these in a while. And, um, my bad. Okay, this one, I just wanted to show you, um, I've got like a used music hall. Um, as y'all know, I am a sucker for used music because used music makes me sad because like, somebody bought that and then they got it home and they didn't like it and they gave it away or they're selling it and that makes me sad it's like little orphan children and I just want to buy them all so this first one I got right here it's country I'm not a big country fan anymore I like country um in the 90s like when I was uh that's when I was growing up and that's the country music I know um and like 80s country um this one right here is Myla Mason um, I got this one at Goodwill, and I think at Goodwill they're two fifty. Um, she's only she only ever had one song that I can remember, and it was a Dark Horse. Um, I just went ahead and bought it just because I do like that one song. And then the cool thing is, is like I got home and I was looking at it, and it's got that little thing on there that says for promotional use only. You know, don't sell it and blah, blah, blah. I love when I get CDs like that. Um, I've got a Goo Goo Dolls CD like that. My friend Stephanie, she bought it used. And then she got it home and got to looking at it. And she's like, oh, man, it's got this cool stuff written on it. And she's like, here, you can have it. And I'm like, sweet. That's why you're my bestie. Um, now, these next three right here, um, these three uh, Tiffany picked out for me. Um, they went to the flea market where she lives and they had them three First for five. First one is Ace of Base. Um, sorry, I'm trying to do it so you don't have a glare. Um, this has got the sign on it. It's got all that she wants, don't turn around, and the sign. Um, and all she wants, apparently, this is a remix at the end of this one. Um, this is from 92. Yeah, I was little. I was 10, actually. Um, yeah, I don't know much music by them other than what was on the radio. So, but this was a good one. That This is the one that Tiff picked out for me. This other one is uh, when I talked to y'all about my tapes, uh, some of my favorite tapes. Um, I had this on tape because my mom got it for me um, when I got good grades on our report card. And I kind of think that she got it for her mainly because I never ended up with it. She always had it. And it's an Amy Grant Heart in Motion. Yay! And this is, what year is this one? 91. And I basically love, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. There's eleven songs on here, and I love over half of them. It's got Good For Me, Baby Baby, Every Heartbeat, That's What Love Is For, and I Will Remember You. Those were all singles. But I like Galileo, too, and that wasn't a single, I'm pretty sure. This, I, I mean, it just reminds me of, uh, of being little. The cars are playing. Hmm. And this last one has been my favorite CD for like the past two weeks since Tiff got them for me. Um, and that is YouTube, The Joshua Tree. Um, when I went to Goodwill um, and I bought, it wasn't when I bought Mama Mason, I think it was before that. Um, it was like somebody had dropped off their entire U2 collection. There was like freaking eight U2 CDs there. And I wish I would have bought them now. I really do wish I would have bought them because I, I didn't have any of them because I'm a iTunes person. I just buy what I want to listen to. But I am so freaking in love with this damn CD. And, I mean, the Joshua Tree just reminds me of my youth. I mean, it reminds me of being really little. This came out in 87. In 87, I was five. And I remember watching this stuff on MTV. And um, Bono, I'm sorry, but he was, like, really hella hot. Like, he's pretty damn cute in this. And the Joshua Tree has where the streets have no name. I still haven't found him looking for it with or without you. Um... I posted a bunch of videos on my Facebook not long ago. It was when Tiffany had first got me this. And um, I was talking with my friend Amy about With or Without You. And she was talking about how she likes in the video where he, like, you know, sticks his hands up in the air like this. And um, 
you know, that's pretty cool. My favorite part about the whole video is the fact that Bono has a freaking guitar strapped to his back and never plays it. Never plays it. Throughout the whole freaking video, it's just like hanging there lifelessly on his back. But you know what? He, he's freaking Bono. And he's like, bitches, I don't care. I'm freaking Bono. I can let this hang from my back if I want. I don't ever have to play it. This is an accessory to my sweet, sweet vest outfit because I'm rocking the leather tight black vest. You know? And then at the very end, Towards the end of the video, like seriously, at the very end, he like swings it around and you think he's going to play it, but no, he just starts swinging it around. He's like, Shh, I don't care. I'm Bono. Um, these next CDs I got from Peddler's Mall and these ones were really cheap. Um, the reason I got excited because the cars, um, I bought the cars greatest hits is what I got right here. And you know, what was that when they were singing? You might think I'm crazy, but this got just what I needed. And you might think, um, my best friend's girl, shake it up, drive. Um, I only know their singles. I don't know anything else on this CD, but I got it because it was $2. Uh, these next CDs that I got were only a dollar. For reals, only a dollar. Um, the first one is Taylor Dane. Tell it, what is it? Yeah, tell it to my heart. She looks really, really young on this CD. This CD is from 87. And this has got Tell It To My Heart, Don't Rush Me, and I'll Always Love You. I mean, seriously. Look at that her. That is some sweet, curly 80s hair right there. And Taylor Dane has, like, the freaking biggest lips. And I think, she, well, she's obviously had some plastic surgery since this. And her lips are hella huge right now. Like, they're already big, but they're hella huge. Now. The next one is Mariah Carey. And this has got, this is her very first C. Um, it's got Division of Love, I Don't Want to Cry, and Someday, which is my favorite, favorite Mariah Carey song. Someday is my absolute favorite. I'm not a huge Mariah Carey fan, but, uh, I mean, she, she can sing. She can hit them high notes and uh, make dogs cry. So, um, the next one I got is also country, but it was only a dollar and I only know one, two, three, no, oh, there's three songs on here. There's more songs on here than I thought. Um, this is Blackhawk. I don't know if any of y'all know who Blackhawk is, but this is from 93. Check out his sweet curly mullet right there. That's a pretty sweet nineties mullet. Um, they, I don't even know if they had another song, actually. Goodbye Says It All uh, is the one that I really, really know. And they played it a whole hell of a lot. We were in Louisiana at the time, and we came back um, to Kentucky to visit with my grandma. And, like, this was, like, the song of the summer. Like, they freaking played it all the damn time, and they played the video all the time. And my aunt was visiting, visiting from California, and even she made the comment. She's like, if I hear this damn song one more time, you know, and... Yeah, I'll have to put the video down down there so you can see that one. And this one right here is my last one. And I cannot believe that somebody was even selling it for reals. And it is A Boy Named Goo for a dollar. For a dollar. You see that? For a dollar. Um, I love every freaking song on here. So I don't, you know, if you need, just look it up because they're all, every one of them are good. They do a cover of Slave Girl and Disconnected. Really awesome. Um, and this CD is like practically brand freaking new. Like when I opened it up to like check it, when you pulled it out, you know how when you first pull, when you first buy a CD and you pull it out, it's really, really tight. That's, uh, that sounded, uh, pervy. That's what she said. Um, but anyway, <laughs> You're welcome. The fat girl was crazy if you're watching. I already have two copies of this CD, but I went ahead and I bought it again because um, this is Bug's very first CD. She got a little boom box for Christmas and um, it's got a CD player and a tape player on it. And this is her very first CD. That's all hers. And uh, I bought it for her. And they also had, um, I went and was looking at another one and they just had like a few little CDs. Um, and they had another boy named Goo, but they were trying to sell that one for $5. And it looked worse than this. This one looks brand new. That one looked way worse. And then they had City of Angels soundtrack, too. And I was thinking, well, I'll get that one for Bug, even if it is 5 bucks. you know? She needs that. I opened it up. That CD was scratched to hell. You know, it's like, how do you expect to... Oops. It's like, how do you expect to sell 
this music when it's like totally jacked. Because let me tell you what, I've been burned by uh, used music, especially from Goodwill. Always look at Goodwill. That one time I got home and opened it up, there wasn't even a CD in it. And then the other time I bought one, whatever I bought, I can't remember what it was, wasn't the CD that was in it. And uh, yeah, so always check your used music. Always. And the car CD, it skips during um, the first few songs in the beginning. And I was kind of saying, I'm out there. But I'll live. Maybe I need to clean it a little bit better. So um, that's all, guys. I'll have more Mandy's Music Monday soon. Bye.